What is Metaslav? Metaslav is a comprehensive platform developed by BlockSec to assist users in effectively tracking and investigating all crypto activities. The platform was introduced in beta in January 2023 and has recently completed its official release. Metaslav users can easily track funds, visualize fund flows, monitor real-time fund movements, save important information, and collaborate by sharing findings with others. Currently, they support over 13 different blockchains, including BTC, ETH, Tron, Polygon, and more. It's very important to understand that not everyone is familiar with the concept of crypto tracking and on-chain sleuthing. Let's take a look at a few scenarios where Metasleuth can be used to help you understand a few of its capabilities. DER or do your own research. For trading enthusiasts, we highly recommend conducting comprehensive research before making any investment decisions. A practice commonly referred as the RR do your own research. In the world of cryptocurrencies, opportunities and risks coexist, making it crucial to make informed choices. Metas Love can be your light in avoiding investments in low quality or unreliable projects, often referred as shitcoins. By leveraging this platform, you can gain valuable insights into the market, assess credibility of projects and developers, and mitigate potential risks in your investment journey. Stolen Funds Tracking As mentioned before, the world of cryptocurrency is full of risks and dangers. Users might face the unfortunate situation of losing their funds due to scams, phishings, or other reasons. In this situation, Metaslove can be used to track where the funds went and gather valuable clues to help you find a hacker and recover your stolen money. Metaslove is designed to make it easier for you to understand what happened to your funds and get the necessary help to recover them. Compliance Measures Metaslove provides you know your transactions, or KYT, and address screening services to ensure regulatory compliances for crypto businesses and companies. While these features are currently accessible through demo requests only, the labels and compliance score displayed with Metaslove effectively represent their capabilities in this domain. Forensic Analysis Metaslove enables you to conduct comprehensive investigations and forensic analysis. Whether you are dealing with a suspicious transaction or need to delve deep into the details of a security instead, Metaslove provides you with the necessary tools and insights to analyze the, funds, the flow of funds. With their forensic analysis capabilities, you can uncover valuable evidence and gain a comprehensive understanding of blockchain activities for legal, investigative, or research purposes. Now let's take a look at two interesting cases here where we can see Metaslove being used in practice. Take a look at a phishing scam and see if we can understand where the money went in that case. So let's take a look. I'm going to paste the transaction hash here. And I'm going to click on the center graph tool. We can see that on 17th of July, the user got fished and had 2,500 medic tokens trained from this wallet. Let me just label this as user to make it easier to read. Now, let's try to understand what happened to this Matic. So we can click here to get a further view on what are the transfers that, that this scam contract made. And we can see all the addresses related and all the transfers. And luckily, BlockSec has a really cool tool that can help us see this in a much easier way, which is the token filter. So because we're looking into Matic, let's filter just for Matic. So I'm going to click here. Select Matic on forward. And what look at what interesting case on the 18, one day after the fake smart contract exchanged tokens on you. Wow. So or these are most likely the phones that were stolen from the user. Now let's try to see what happened to these. And we can do that by simply clicking on the phone flow. Look here, and we're going to add that. We're going to open the edge list, and on the edge list, we can click on the detail. And within the details, we're going to find the hash of the transaction. If we copy the hash, add it here, 
Now we can add context to this transaction using another transaction. And we can see that the result of this transaction was a return of 0 0.94 ether. Now let's try to understand how this ether was used. And we can do that simply clicking on the phishing smart contract. And once again, we're going to have all the addresses correlated and all the transfers. But now we want to do a filter here. Let's filter maybe from the day of the scan. Let's go. And let's pick it here. 18, maybe from 0. And for the end date, we can do today. The token we're looking for is Ether. And look at how rich this filter is. We have block range, the type, the amounts. And let's look at also Ether moving out. So after doing the filter, I can simply apply it. And I have a series. Let's look into transfers. Maybe let's look into a data closer to the date of the scan. And interestingly, day after the tokens were swapped, the one dot or Ether were sent to this account. So we can safely say that this is most likely holding the funds. This shows the power of how Meta's love can be used and money can be traced. Now we're going to take a look at a little bit more advanced case, uh, looking at the user wallet and trying to understand what happens to the tokens that were trained on this wallet to efficient scan. I can use the address, but I can also use the DNS domain here. So I know that Lyle Okay. And I know this can happen around February 25. So I'm going for the date. And for the end date, I'm going for February 28. Okay. Let's focus on the outflow of cash. So I'm going to uncheck in here. And let's fix MLIs. Okay, so right in here, you can see a bunch of transactions. And I can see that the, tot the user was trained off 500,000 data tokens and almost $2,000 in USDC. Now, let's try to understand what happened with this money. And because I have a bunch of different operations going on here, I'm going to filter only for the tokens that I'm looking into. So I'm going to go to the token filter. I'm going to select USDC and data. Let's click on form. Let's click to organize the layout. And look, now I can see that both of these tokens were sent to our swap at some point. Now let's see what happened in the upcoming transaction. Let's click here to open the edge list. Let's click on detail and let's copy the hash for the data swap. So let's close this and add it here. Yeah. Right in there, I can see that the user got 12 ether from this only this swap. Now let's look into the other one. Let's click here. Okay, copy the hash. Let's paste it. And now I can see that the user got a total of 14.5 meter. Now, what we may be asking each other is how do happen with this year and where we went through? Let's try to figure out that out. To do that, let's click on the fish, the fishing contract. And let's put up a filter here, kind of looking at the same dates. I'm actually going to filter, transfers, filter. I'm going to filter once again, February 25. Let's put zero, two, February 28. Okay. And let's do the token we want to see is ether, and the direction we want to see is out. So let's just apply this 
And we can already see a bunch of interesting transfers that happen from this account. So let's click to show them. And now we can see all these addresses, but enter from the phishing. So we have 70FF6 enter. We have 86 2 enter. We have another phishing contract receiving 8 enter. In under 10 minutes, we can already see the first outcome of this investigation and some suspect addresses. This is how cool Metasluff is. Metasluff is really exciting. It can really enhance your crypto experience. If you have any more questions or need assistance maximizing your Metasluff benefits, feel free to reach out to BlockSack's team. With Metasluff, you can confidently navigate the crypto world, get better insights into what's happening, and protect your investment.